Hello. I tell you, can't win for losing. My potatoes got attacked by gnats again. And I'm, what are some of these two days now? Check this out. How much I have on here in two days. I didn't know I had this many. I mean, I used the lime a couple of weeks ago. And I thought I was doing good. But I guess not because they are back. I don't want to touch it because it comes off of my hand. Look at this. And there's the other one. I have two in this potato. I'm surprised if my potato will make it because they're just like the root. I mean, this they're killing them, man. Eh? Look here. I don't think this is going to make I don't think. Let me see. Yeah, the root is done. So I'm going to lay these down later. And just cover it with soil. Just leave the tip open and see if I can help, if I can rescue any of it. These things are so limp. You know, I mean, these nets, man, this, look here. It's just done. And it has light, isn't it? It has its own personal private light above it. So, I'm going to try, lay them down later. Lay them down later. <laughs> And see if I can and cover it with soil. Just leave. I'm just going to leave the tips open. You know, just the tips above the soil. And this one also. I'm just going to put the tip above the soil. And fill the container. I have other little ones, you know, but I'm not sure how long they're going to last. So I have a little one right here too. That, you know, they're coming up. And these two are doing good. These are the only two that's doing good. The rest is suffering bad. And like I said, attack of the gnats. Okay. And my potato. I guess they love potatoes because over here. That is my sweet potatoes. I guess they love potatoes because they are the main thing that's been attacked and destroyed. Anyway, just a little quick update on my potatoes and my nut problem. Take care. This is a sad end to my potatoes. If you remember, I planted these potatoes from skins. Well, I thought I had the fungus gnat problem taken care of. I guess I was not. I had lime and I didn't do all the plants like I was supposed to. I just did a, this and another one, a few more. So the fungus not weren't spread to the other containers which I, that, that I did not take care of. So I used it. I made some neem oil mixture, soaked this, and I still did not get them. I had, this is my third yellow nut catcher. So I messed up on the lime. I messed up on the neem oil. Some I had to be because I had to mess up because it didn't work. And these, I had, this is my third one. But as you can see, I've lost my potatoes. All those nice little skins. There. Look at that. The only thing left is this right here. So I'm going to take this container and put it outside. It's beautiful in the daytime. But it's in the 40s at night. I'm just going to take my chance because, I mean, I'm looking. This nut thing is not going anywhere. And I don't want it to spread to the rest of my containers. So I'm just take, doing this my one right here. Take it outside. It's going to rain like crazy tomorrow. I'm just leave it out there. And I go from there. You can see the net flying around. I can't believe. Um, I just can't believe I jinxed myself last time. When I, when I first planted, I said, oh, I don't have anything flying around. Oh, yes, I did. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video.